Primary Election Day in Pennsylvania is here. The polls will open at 7 o'clock this morning. Election Day already historic, and that is because of what is drawn down here. Washington Green, Fayette, Westmoreland County, right there, part of what is now the new 14th Congressional District being used for the first time. Lisa Washington joins us now with a closer look at some of the other key races around the region. Lisa? That's right, Rick, and we're going to start with that 14th district, that new district. As you said, those voters will be casting ballots today uh, for congressional districts that were redrawn following a court order. Now, you outlined what that 14th district covered. There's, there are two Republican candidates who are running there, Representative Rick Saccone and State Senator Guy Reschenthaler. Saccone, you may remember, lost a congressional bid two months ago to Democrats and the old 18th Congressional District. They are also Democrats. There are four of them. They are Bibiana Boerio, who is the former Jaguar Cars executive, along with Adam Sedlock, a Fayette County psychologist, Robert Solomon, and Thomas Prigg, who is a veteran and a neuroscience researcher. Now to the U.S. Senate. This is one that hasn't been getting a lot of publicity, but still an important race in Pennsylvania. There are two Republican candidates who would like to replace U.S. Senator Bob Casey. They are Representative Lou Barletta. Now he is endorsed by the Pennsylvania GOP. He's also endorsed by President Trump and Representative Jim Christiana. Again, these two state representatives would like to have the U.S. Senate seat that is currently held by Democratic U.S. Senator Bob Casey, and Senator Casey is one of two, I'm uh, sorry, one of ten U.S. Senators, Democrats, who represent states that were won by President Trump and back in 2016. So certainly some interesting races to keep our eyes out for today. The polls, as you said, open at 7 this morning. I'm Lisa Washington, KDKA-TV Morning News.